In a startling development on the high seas, the Iranian Revolutionary Guard Corps, or IRGC, has once again raised international tensions. Recently, one of their warships made a bold approach towards a U.S. naval base, and the world is watching closely. The Strait of Hormuz, a strategic choke point that has been the backdrop for countless geopolitical standoffs. On a seemingly ordinary day, U.S. naval personnel were stunned as radar screens lit up with an unexpected visitor. An IRGC warship was on a direct course towards their position. This isn't the first time the IRGC has tested the resolve of the U.S. Navy. In recent years, these confrontations have become almost routine, each one a high-stakes game of cat and mouse. But what makes this latest incident different? This approach was more brazen than usual. The IRGC vessel came within striking distance, showcasing their advanced capabilities and daring the U.S. to respond. Such maneuvers are not just military tactics, they are political messages. The IRGC is asserting its presence and reminding the world of its strategic ambitions in the Persian Gulf. Back on the bridge, U.S. commanders had a decision to make. Engage and risk escalation, or show restraint and gather intelligence. The tension was palpable as both sides waited for the other to blink. Minutes felt like hours. The IRGC ship maintained its course, cutting through the waves with purpose. On board the U.S. ship, preparations were underway for any possible scenario. But then, as suddenly as it had appeared, the Iranian warship veered off, disappearing into the horizon. This incident is a clear message from Iran they are unafraid of U.S. presence and are willing to push boundaries. It also serves as a reminder of the fragile balance of power in the region. Such encounters highlight the importance of diplomatic channels and the potential for miscalculations that could lead to wider conflict. As the world watches these dangerous waters, the need for dialogue and de-escalation becomes ever more critical. Will cooler heads prevail, or are we on the brink of a new naval conflict? Stay tuned as we continue to follow this developing story. Subscribe, hit the notification bell, and leave your thoughts in the comments below. What do you think about the IRGC's latest move? Until next time, stay informed and stay engaged.